What's up guys, Solpro9 here, bringing you a new team deathmatch, 38 and 2, and I'm going to show you how to lock down a position on team deathmatch, like completely lock down. And the position I'm going to be locking down is the one that I'm, cur I'm currently at, as you can see my streaks, there's sentry gun, guardian, and yeah, UAV. Oh, it's not going to happen right away, towards the middle of the game though, but um, by now you probably noticed my un not new intro but I kind of modified it you could probably tell that I added the dust particle effects in the beginning and at the end I kind of added you know a, a different transition I didn't like the original one where you know you heard music you know you were jamming out and then it just stopped and then you hear my voice immediately so I kind of added that new transition at the end I said I'm still working on it that's not my final product still learning how to use Sony Vegas Pro but um yeah, this game I was just playing with my friend Mini8745. And, uh, in this game, uh, this is whenever I first started playing on a 10 sensitivity. <coughs> and I must say that it works really, really well now. Um, the disadvantages and advantages of that sensitivity is that you'll notice that on some parts of the game my aim is just completely like wow off and some parts it's just like dang that's some amazing aim so it's kind of like like right there for example you know I'm pretty sure anyone else would have killed that second guy easily but um oh as of today I got a completely new controller brand new never used before I got it for 15 bucks from a friend at school yeah I can't believe I didn't hear his footsteps so you know my sound whoring abilities are impaired <laughs> but um yeah I got a brand new controller this game I'm using my uh you know my first Xbox controller it's terrible it's just not good at all so hopefully with this controller I'm gonna be able to bring you some better gameplay with better aim so I mean I can honestly say that most of the times that I die it's just because of my aim it's just way off I have terrible aim in my opinion I don't have, you know, those scuff gaming controllers like all MOG Pros have, or with the paddles on the back. I was planning on buying one, though, but I don't really have the money at the moment. But I highly recommend those controllers. Those are the best that you can possibly get. But yeah, this game I'm using AN94 with the uh, Select Fire. No silencer this time. <laughs> right there, that was just... We both had terrible aim. But, you know, on my part, that I shouldn't be doing that. <laughs> I'm gonna activate my UAV, take him out, and this is just, oh my god, I got lucky that I was spraying my ass off. Oh shoot, I just said ass. <laughs> I was spraying, I said it again. I was spraying my butt off. And right there, I don't know, I, I don't know why I put that guard in there, but I think I do get a kill off of that, like later in the game, because it's still there. But, uh, so it really did help, even though I had no clue why I put it there. And then, yeah, I saw, uh, saw that charge. I don't know why I ran into it like that. Get that guy, and this guy, oh my god. He probably thought he had me with that Simtex. He's just like, eh, I'm just gonna ignore him. Right, you can see the accuracy, though, of that gun. Right there, I <clears throat> do not know what happened. I thought I shot him, you know, with two bursts, which is more than enough to kill him, but, eh, whatever. It's Call of Duty. Things like that happen. Beats me with the pistol. So I placed this sentry gun here to guard that entire area right there. Nice voice crack. And uh, yeah, look at that. My, that's when my guardian's doing work. <laughs> Still there. But yeah, um, mm, I've been using the PDW more often now, but like I just unlocked the MSMC again, so probably go back to that. But I'll most likely post some PDW oh, gameplay. Yeah. And as for my assault rifle review, um, I'll probably do that sometime this week. And I have all the information, I just need to actually take the time to sit down and create a commentary over it. But, um, yeah, go ahead and give you guys some good information on assault rifle stats, damage, etc. Ready to fire. And right here, that sentry gun just pretty much guards anything in front, which is very useful. And you'll notice I'll be around this area and then I'll get my sentry gun again as well as the guardian and you're just gonna see complete lockdown of that area 
they're not even going to be able to get within there. Because this is pretty much the area that most people fight for. This is the main, one of the main choke points of the map. And right there, I just had the better aim, or the better connection, whatever works on Call of Duty. <laughs> a connection works almost all the time. You can have the worst aim ever. And if you have that better connection, then yeah, you win. <laughs> Not all the time, though, but most of the time. Guardian assist right there. There we go. Got a guardian on the other side. Two sentries in here. No one's getting in. Or out. <laughs> they all lock us down in here. <laughs> but, um, yeah, unfortunately for us, no one had a. Uh, no one really took advantage of blind, blind eye this game. And that's where uh, it would have been a little bit more useful to have two guardians instead of one uh, or two sentries. Because, you know, it doesn't matter if you have a blind eye, you're not getting through that. And right here, I heard someone get shanked. I'm like, oh shoot! Terrible aim by me. Good thing he missed that ballistic knife, and I did that by accident. <laughs> but uh, we still got this locked down. We just have to guard the front area. That's pretty much it. And then I am very low on ammo, so I kind of waited out. I am expecting someone to come. Nope, he's not dead. Jump, kill him, take his gun, and it's a crossbow. <laughs> I've never used it on this game before until now. Pick up one of my favorite guns, Scorpion Evo. Of course, I like the Scorpion way better in uh, COD 4. Guardian ready that was actually a pretty good kill right there. Got another Guardian. Not enough time to put it anywhere, so I just randomly place it. And I have three Guardians on the map. That's amazing. And, yeah, Guardian Suppress, so I go ahead and rush that guy. Sentry gun ready for deployment. Sentry gun not available. Don't know why I did that. Confirm. Take him out. Get another sentry. Place it in this. Oh shoot! Someone's in there. I guess he got scared. Yeah, place it in the same spot. Oh, this is pretty much how to lock down this map completely. Dodge that Betty. I'm not gonna die by a bouncing Betty. And I get the last kill here. Just play that in slow motion and ask yourself, how the hell did I get that? Nice I don't know. It was weird. But, uh, yeah, that's it for now. I hope you found this video useful. And subscribe, comment, please. And I'll go ahead and post some more videos later. Peace out.